Hi, I'm Pauline. Okay, so today I'm going to show you how to distress leather shoes, leather boots. I distressed my leather cowboy boots that I love. They were already very well worn, but I wanted it more distressed, more, more like beaten up. And some leather uh, sandals that I distressed, but they have to be real leather. They can't be faux. If you, you, if you just try to distress faux, you're going to ruin everything. We shrunk the, and we stretched the leather jackets, remember? But they also have to be real leather. They can't be faux leather. So now we're going to distress sandals and we're going to distress some boots. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Thumbs up if you like it. And the material is acetone, uh, kitchen towels, and uh, a sponge, that very uh, wire sponge that you can... You, you, you clean your pans. I used a very light one, but you can use it or sandpaper if you wish, if you want it more beaten up. So I hope you enjoy it and thumbs up and I'll see you tomorrow. Okay, so today we're gonna distress some leather. You can distress, I distress this. I was going to continue if you wanna do that. And we can always do with something else. Your favorite cowboy boots. Okay, so this is before. It's a normal cowboy boot. See? Mm, nothing special. See? Mm, nothing special. And this is the after. See? Right over here, how it's distressed. Here and here. Okay, so this is what you're going to do. And here. You can do this with any type of, yeah, what? of leather. It has to be real leather. It can't be like faux leather. This is what you're gonna need, acetone, or I use nail polish. The sponge, you see, it's already dirty here with the, the leather. So this, this, and some paper just for you to keep on rubbing so that you can end up with everything distressed. So I'm gonna continue distressing this a little bit and my cowboy boots. You see in the back? The difference? You do that with your leather jacket. You just put the acetone on the, the sponge. Just keep on rubbing, rubbing, rubbing wherever you want to distress. Wherever. Do it outside because of the smell, if you wish. And it's going to look gorgeous. Hope you like it. Hope you have a great day. I'll see you tomorrow.